There's a lot of items here. We can get an encounter here and we can... So you're not a trainer? Oh. Okay, we got the cover fossil. Doesn't matter. Does not matter. We got another encounter here. Go down here. So that's where we get the fossil from. Trainers, Lee Trainer Hugo here with the next episode of the Pokemon White Randomizer Nuzlocke. How are you all doing? I hope you're having a fantastic day. Last time we had a very clean episode and it was a very easy episode where we got our third gym badge. This episode is being recorded again directly after that one. Uh, the reason being, that episode not much happened, so it's going to be an easier one for me to edit. And I was like, I want to do something that's going to be a bit harder to edit. If I have an easy episode, like where not many things happen, I will record more than one in the same day, I've decided. But this is the same day as before. But if you're hyped for this episode, don't forget to smash a like on this video. And we're going to have a very quick team recap. Let's go. First off, we've got Willow, the Verizian. Grass fighting type, modest nature, hyper cut for the ability, quick attack, takedown, double kick, and magical leaf. Next, we've got Eustace, the Gyarados, uh, water flying type, brave nature, in a focus for the ability, bite, tackle, splash. Level 21, Desmond, our starter Pokemon, the Excadrill, Ground Steel type, level 22, Sati Nature, Water Absorb for the ability, Metal Claw, Mud Sport, Rapid Spin, and Dig. Next we have Puff the Magic Dragonite, Dragon Flying type, Bold Nature, Hyper Cutter for the ability, Slam, Dragon Rage, Thunder Wave, Twister, holding the Grecius Orb, holding the Focus Sash, Desmond is. And then we have Bailey, level 21, the Cottony. Grass type, relaxed nature, cute charm for the ability, growth, leech seed, razor leaf, and mega drain, holding the experience share. And then finally, we've got empathy, the psychic type, mesprit, level 22, lax nature, rest, confusion, swift, and protect with the reckless ability. So, I am going to take the experience share off of Bailey because I don't think. I think if we catch something decent in this episode, this episode we're going to have a lot of encounters. And a lot of battles and stuff. If we catch something amazing, I think Bailey is the Pokemon that we're going to put in the box. And I feel bad for doing that because I really like Cottony and Whimsicott. But the odds of us finding a shiny stone or a sunstone, so which we need to evolve it, is very, very slim in this game. Um, hence the random, because of the randomizer. But let's go. We got a battle with Bianca right now. Bianca will meet us in here. There we go. There's Bianca. Let's have our first rival battle in a while. Let's battle Bianca. It's going to be fine and dandy and easy and awesome. I am looking forward to this fight. And we're going to get some encounters. We're going to battle Sharon as well. But we're going to have a battle with Pansy here. What is Pansy going to have? Pansy has got three, four Pokemon. And she starts off with her Togetic. Okay, so she's got a Togetic. That is fine. That is perfect for us to kill. Actually, it's a flying type, isn't it? Oh, that could be bad. Um, Willow, double kick. Okay, it does neutral damage. Okay, it's a flying type as well. Using Yawn, that's fine. I'm going to get you out of there, Willow. Because I don't think Willow should be used in this fight, really. Let's put Puff in. Puff, get in there and Dragon Rage it. Puff is definitely one of my favorite mons we've got on this team. Sweet Kiss, that's going to confuse me? Yeah, it confuses. Okay, it's fine. The confusion is fine. We're going to Dragon Rage and hopefully not hit ourselves. And we didn't hit ourselves. That's what I like to see. Well done, Puff. There we go. Togetic is down. Easy battle, this. Next, you've got Alatias. Yo, you got Sherry. I had Alatias in my Soul Silver. Let's play. Latias doesn't learn many good dragon type moves, so using Twister should do a lot of damage to it. Okay, it didn't do that much, but Dragon Rage will. Using Wish, I'm going to kill you anyway, so you're not going to get a chance to use that unless we hit ourselves. We didn't. This should kill the Latias. Latias is out of there. Easy, easy experience there for Puff. Puff is now level 22. I freaking love Puff right now. Next, you have a Kingler. Um... Okay, I'm going to let Bailey fight this. Give Bailey an actual, like, battle so you can see Bailey in action. 
Let's go Kingler versus Bailey. And we're going to use Razor Leaf. Okay, that didn't do anything. Oh, Wish. I was like, why is it healing? Using Harden, that's fine. I'm going to use a Leech Seed. Leech Seed the crap out of you. And we're going to... I think we're more of a special attack Pokemon anyway. So if you use special attacks, we should be more fine with Bailey. Bailey should be able to kill this very, very easily. This is going to be a very easy battle, this. Oh, look at that. Look at that. That did a lot of damage. This Kingler doesn't stand a chance. And we're also going to do another Mega Drain. Using a Super Potion, that's fine. But this Mega Drain is going to put you back right where you started. And then we're going to do another Mega Drain. And Bailey is going to get her first ever win in a battle. That's what I like to see. Come on. Absolutely destroy. And it is dead. There we go. Kingler is dead. That's what I like to see. Level 22 on Bailey. And finally, you have got Whistle and Poison Powder. I'm going to get rid of Le Razor Leaf for that. You're more of a special attacker anyway. Poisoning is a great thing to have. And finally, we have got Meganium. And I am going to go into... I'm going to go into Desmond. Going to go to Desmond for this. Desmond needs some experience. Desmond is our starter. Desmond did have a very, very good battle against Meganium back when the series started. So let's do this pansy with download. Okay, so it flip-flops between the two abilities. That's fine. And we are going... Um... My controller has stopped working. There we go. My controller stopped working for some reason. That was weird. That was really weird. I don't know why my controller stopped working. Oh god, this is going to take forever. Okay. Um. Okay, you're actually not a good Pokemon for this. It's going to use Reflect. So let's go to... Hell with it, let's go to Puff. Puff is basically going to become our MVP. Puff is our MVP. Dragon Rage is the reason we are having such a good, easy time with Pokemon here. And Puff resists so many things. Dragon Rage is going to do 40 fixed damage. And you're trying to poison in front of me. Yes, you are in trouble. And I'm going to Dragon Rage again. You're going to heal, that's fine. But again, you're going back to where you were. Sort of. And now I'm going to end you with a slam. See how much this does. Okay, so this is on Meganium. Meganium is basically used to stall. I like using Meganium to stall things. It's a fun Pokemon to stall with. And yeah, that did that. That's fine. And I'm going to end with... I shouldn't have used Dragon Rage there, but meh. It's fine. I used another Dragon Rage. There we go. We have beaten Bianca. Desmond's now level 21. Pansy is defeated. I'll never be a strong trainer like you or Sharon or Iris, but... You know, since we left Nubuma Town, I've met a lot of people and I've been thinking about what I want to do in life. When you look at it that way, Pokemon have given me a lot of new experiences. Having my Pokemon stolen was just really hard and I felt really unsure. Still, I gotta say, I'm really glad I went. I've learned so much on this journey and I've learned about being with Pokemon is really, really important. Okay, well, I hope to see you again soon, Hugo. Bianca is probably one of my favorite rivals in the Pokemon series. Uh, more so than Sharon. Sharon is a bit of a douche. Go in here, talk to you, and we can heal in here, which is great. There's a lot of items here. I'm not going to do any gyms today. Um, we have done a lot of gym battles recently. Um, I'm not going to battle Sharon just yet. I want to explore this area. And get some items. Got some more battles to do. So that's fine. It's a Bidoof. I like Bidoof. And it has pressure. 
Doof is putting you under pressure. But Willow took that out with ease. Next you have a Scolopede! It's Yzma! You have an Yzma! Yo, it's so clean. I love that Pokemon so much. Scolopede is one of my favorite mons. Oh, you lucky bugger. Are you just going to protect every turn to do that? No, you're not. Okay. AI is not that smart. Nearly level 22 on Desmond. Can we get any items over here? Is there an item nearby? Items? I want to battle all these trainers. I should probably keep some of these trainers in case I need a grind to do a grinding montage. Um, just because, well... In case we get something new. But as well, we've got the experience share now, so we can just whack that on any new mom we have. Pelipper. Um, huh. Puff. Puff, puff, puff. That's fine. Do that. I don't have any fire type moves anyway. Braviary, stay in. Yeah, I'm going to try and save as many battles as possible just in case we get anything. Um, I'm probably going to do like the Relic Castle and stuff today. I think that'd be good. Good to do. Get like a fossil encounter. Go back to a couple of cities prior and get some awesome stuff. Get ourselves our fossil encounter and everything like that. So, I think that's a good idea. We're going to just do a lot of encounters today. Because last time it was the gym. We're going to do encounters here. There's an item over here. What else could we have got here? Could have got an Entei. We got a Verizian. I'm more than okay with a Verizian, so. Master Ball. Ah, uh, flavoured mail. Favoured mail, even. I don't know why I said flavoured mail. I want to get all these items. Okay, I'm not going to walk behind you. I'm not going to walk behind you, sir. What have you got? You've got a Drifflim. Which is not good for me at all. Uh, Eustace. Eustace can bite it. Eustace also needs to learn some new moves. Willow's level 22. Nose pass. I didn't want to go into Drillbur, but that's fine. I can metal claw it. I don't know why I called you Drillbur, because you're an Excadrill. You lived my metal claw. Vect Sports. That's a good ability for a nose pass, actually. Hone Claws. Um, get rid of Mud Sport. I'm never going to use Mud Sport. And finally, you've got a Quagsire going into Willow. Willow is designed to kill ground and water types. Because we just use Magical Leaf, and that will kill it straight away. There we go. Easy peasy. I want to be as sneaky as possible. Okay, we do have to have some battles here, but it's, it's fine. I just want to get as many items and as many encounters as possible. Volibee. I've used a Volibee before. Um, airlock. Okay, it's fine. Um, we're going to go into... Let's go into Eustace. Let Eustace get the experience for this one. Okay. Okay, I get it. Oh, wait. You're... Uh, never mind then. We're gonna go into Puff. We're going to Puff. And we're going Dragon Rage. And Twister, I guess. 
Buff hit himself. Okay, Puff, come on. And Puff got the kill. There we go. Easy peasy. Not much experience given there. In fact, I can cure that paralysis. I completely forgot about that. Paralyze heal. Give that to Desmond. We've got 13 potions. Super potions. Healing everybody up. And we're going to keep going forward. Please be a master ball. Grudge! What does that do? I've never I've never used that attack. I've never seen that attack before. Grudge, what do you do? Uh, ghost type depletes PP. Hmm. Oh, it's that attack. Okay, I know what attack that is. If So basically, if Pokemon faints... It was at this moment he knew. He fucked up. There were Giratinas here, and I've got a Greasius Orb. Okay, this route is just full of legendaries. This route... I, I'm, I'm a little bit salty I've used the Master Ball now. But at the same time, Willow has put in the finest of work. I am happy with that. Just could have had a Giratina. Which would have been very clean. At least we didn't get a Starly here. Even though Starly is amazing. Like, Star Rave, the Star Raptor is a freaking amazing Pokemon. Master Ball. We got a fossil! Yes! We have a fossil! We got another encounter, guys! I'm gonna go back. Once we've been to the Relic Castle, I'm gonna head back and see what that thing is. And we, we've got some backups. We're gonna have some backup mons in this episode. That's what I like to see. I like having backups. I like having as many mons as possible. And we're also gonna battle Cheren because we should do. Uh, I'm gonna battle Cheren now. Uh, go and get some encounters and then with our two fossils that we're gonna get, we're gonna get two statics because fossils count the static mon. We're gonna get the two statics and we're gonna go back here. So let's battle Cheren. Let's go, Cheren. Bam, 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 bam. Damn, guys, Macargo. You've got a Macargo. I uh, this is not a good matchup. It's a good matchup for half of Willow. For the other half, not so much. So we're gonna go in to. You know what? I'm risking it. I'm risking it. Double kick. We're faster than it. We can probably take a hit. It's going for Harden anyway. So Cheren's not very smart there. And we can go for another double kick and kill the Macargo very easily. Macargo is down. Well done, Willow. That's what I like to see. Sending in a Gabite. That's a dragon. We are going to go to... Huh. I'm going to go to Eustace for this. Eustace needs the experience. Eustace needs to learn some new attacks. He only knows bite and tackle and splash. So he needs to learn some new attacks. Um, I'm of course going to teach... I think I'm going to teach Waterfall to... I'm going to try and teach Waterfall to um, Eustace. I think that's a better attack for it. He's more of a physical attacker anyway than a special attacker. Okay, the Gabite has just killed itself. Level 22 on Eustace. We missed. Eustace gets buffed by the Sandstorm. He's sending in a Marwile. Marwile is my girl. I love Marwile to pieces. And we're going to go into Desmond. It is a pure steel type. We can use ground type moves on it. And hopefully that will do a decent amount of damage. It's not a fairy type in this gen. Let's do Dig. I love Marwile. Wow. 
Super effective. Killed it in one. Desmond is a beast. And now he's sending in his starter Pokemon, the Illumise. And we're gonna... We're gonna stay with Desmond, I think. Keep Desmond in. Desmond versus the Illumise. It's using Cloud9. That's fine. And we are gonna use Metal Claw and hopefully end this battle because that would be really useful. Let's get rid of his Illumise. Okay, that didn't do very much. We did lower my attack sharply with... Thingy. It has Wish as well. Okay, he's got a healer. But we killed it. Critical hit. It's dead. Absolutely easy. Level 23 on Desmond. That's what I like to see. Let's get some more encounters and then we will go and do the thing. So he... The uh, extra he was reading... Where basically she wants to meet us in the by, by Nimbasa City, which is just to the north of us. So let's go get these items. Master Ball. Another icy rock. Okay. And we're gonna get some encounters. We can get our relic castle encounter, and we're going to get our um other encounter that we can get, like the Desert Resort encounter. After battling this guy. What have you got? You've got a Amana Alma Mamola, which is a Pokemon I absolutely despise. I hate Alma Mamola. Uh, it's not a Carbink. Carbink is still my least favorite Pokemon. This is a Water Veil. Uh, we're going to have a kill Aqua Jet. Not going to do much damage to me. I'm a wolf. I'm a grass type. And you're dead. Get out of here. Level 23 on Willow. That is what I like to see. So, let's go over here. Is there any items? Do you have anything for us? Mud Bomb? Ooh, Mud Bomb. That'd be a decent move to teach... Um... Figgy. That'd be a decent move... If he can learn it, Mud Bomb. Very lower accuracy. Desmond can learn it, so let's see. That's not as good as Dig. And it is a special attack. Nah, I'm not going to teach it. I'm not going to teach it just because you're more of a physical attacker. Desmond's more of a physical attacker anyway. And I don't really want to um, do that. Okay, Desert Resort. We can get a Pokemon here in the Desert Resort. Our Desert Resort encounter is... War Turtle! Yes! That's good. Another Water-type Pokemon. We can catch that quite easily. That's an easy Pokemon to catch. I'm just going to quick attack you. Just bite on me. It's not going to do anything. It's not much this water turtle can do to me. What did I name my water turtle in um, Pokemon, uh, Pokemon Y? I think that's what I'm going to nickname this guy. Got our war turtle back. We're gonna throw a great ball and catch this war turtle while I look up what I called my. Uh... I need to look up what I called. Come on, war turtle, get in the ball. I just need to look up what I called my war turtle in Pokemon Y. Because I have forgotten off at the top of my head. Oh, no. Do I have. That's the question. Do I have... Sorry if you saw my file thing there. There's a file. It's on the screen. Uh, do I have my... I don't have my overlays anymore. Great. Okay. Um, I don't remember what I called War Turtle. Um... Oh, sorry, you're seeing all this stuff on the screen. I need to see what I called it. I 
Okay, I want to... What's the lock guy? Sorry you keep hearing myself. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna use the mouse for a ball. It was called Ross. Ross after the guy from Friends. Hey, there we go. We caught Ross. Ross is back. We've got Ross, the War Turtle. He is back on the team. Sorry you saw the flashes of things popping up on the screen, but yeah, that happens. So we got Ross, the War Turtle. That's what I like. I like having a War Turtle. Again, I'm not going to add anything to the team. He's gone to death, but he's not dead. Uh, we're not going to add anything to the team until we get all of our encounters and we see what we've got. And I can compare. So this is also the desert resort. I'm going to battle this this uh, guy because he's going to have... He's going to be able to like, help us heal and stuff. Don't have a trapping ability, please. Puff. Okay, he doesn't have a trapping ability. That's good. So he meditate. And I'm using Dragon Rage. <laughs> so all I have to say to that is Dragon Rage. Of course, he Hyper Potion. And Drowsy is dead. Heal my Pokemon, Doc. Heal my Pokemon. Thank you. Okay, we... Are there, are, are there items here? Yes, there are. Okay, Master Ball. Choice Band. Okay. Ah, oh, for God's sake, I don't want any more battles. I just want to catch some Pokemon. We have a Gallade. Psychic Fighting type. That's a little bit bad. Um... Not for Eustace though, Eustace can kill you quite easily with a bite. That was a crit. That was a crit. Okay, um... Can we go fast? Double team, okay. That's bad. Come on. I don't... Double teaming again. Okay. Bite did nothing. Um, going into Empathy. Empathy's got Swift. New Swift. It doesn't miss. And it's also... He's not going to do much. Two Empathy because Empathy's bulky. Come on, don't crit, don't crit. Okay, empathy died. It's fine. To be honest, empathy, as much as I like Mesprit, it's fine, it adds up more slots to our team, to our party and whatnot, so. We will be fine as long as he doesn't kill Dragonite. Dragonite got killed. Good. There we go. We lost empathy. That's fine. I'm a little bit upset that we lost empathy there, but it's okay. I didn't want another trainer battle. I know I'm going in the complete wrong direction for the um for the place I need to go, but yeah. Okay, this episode's probably going to be a bit longer than, um, this episode's going to be a longer one, I can just tell. Okay, Mac Punch did a lot of damage. Going to dig. Back of doesn't do very much because it's a freaking ladybug. It's dead. Cheer him. Um, no, I'm staying there. Save him. Didn't do much. It's 
all. It's fine. We're fine. There we go. Killed it. Okay. I need to get these encounters very quickly. But we lost empathy, which is very annoying. So I thought empathy would have been a good Pokemon to keep. I like Mesprit. Mesprit's been putting in the finest of work. Master Ball. Ring out, okay. Not a great TM. But I am going to put a repel up. Where are the repels? Repel. No, it's a great ball. Repels. Use that. That's fine. Okay, I've never seen that thing before. Quick ball. Okay. Right, if we get a legendary, we can throw that at it. First off. Is this the relic castle? Yeah, relic castle. This is like the back entrance. That's the back entrance of the relic castle. I don't need that entrance. I need the other entrance. Master Ball. Clint's tag. Master Ball. Magmarizer. Okay, if we get a magma, give that to it and we get a magmortar. Or magmortar, or whatever you call it. Okay, with these, you just got to walk past them. pick my poison here um there's a lot of items here we can get an encounter here and we can are you not a trainer oh okay we got the cover fossil doesn't matter does not matter we got another encounter here go down here so that's where we get the fossil from Encounter is Zekrom. I am going to quick ball you. Quick ball, quick ball, quick ball, quick ball, quick ball. Come on. Ah, it didn't work. Okay, that's fine. Ancient power. Guys. Zekrom is our encounter. This is being added to the team if we catch it. We should be able to catch this thing. Thunderbolt. We can't really do much to Willow, which is great. Let's catch this thing. Yo, we got a Zekrom. Paralyzed is fine. That is fine. We're going to use quick attack. Prison. Paralyzed can't move anyway. Power. I'm so happy with this. Oh, and all its stats are boosted. That's bad. Um. Oh god. Okay, we're fine. We are fine. You have Dragon Rage. I didn't want to use the fresh waters at all. But I'm taking these turns to heal. I need to buy lemonades and stuff. Okay. Quick attack. Dragon Rage. Heal. I'm just going to start throwing balls. Start throwing balls. Great ball. One. Two. Three. Yes! We got the 
second! We got the box! We got Zekrom. Zekrom, I don't care. Zekrom is being added to the team as well. Let's freaking go! We got a Zekrom. That's what I like to see. I am naming you after the God of Thunder. You are Thor. Oh my god, we got a Zekrom. We got a Zekrom. Master Ball. Ah, Bridge Melody. Okay, if that was a Master Ball, that would have been hilarious if that was a Master Ball. Okay, and there's Alexio in here. There's lots of electric types, that's what I like. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to head back. Oh, has Shadow Tag. Okay, um... We should be fine. Oh my god, guys. We got a freaking Zekrom. Okay, and now I'm gonna put a uh, another rappel up. Let's head back to um, what city is it? Second city in the game. The one with the museum, Nat Green. Let's go back to Nat Green and resurrect these fossils just so we can see what we get. But there's an item down there and I want to see what it is. Master Ball. Heat. That's not a heat rock. We've got a heat rock, like two heat rocks and two icy rocks. Uh, I'm not going to heal because I need to um, see. Pokemon we got, but I'm going to head all the way back to Thingy. Let's head all the way back. It's a lot. It's not a long walk, thankfully, because it should be fine. But I'm going to just run as fast as I can. You've got to go through a forest and stuff. But we're back here in Castilia already. I want to see what these two fossils are, because we got, we've got we literally got four encounters today, which I think is really good. Again, this episode's going to be a bit longer just because we've got to run back. In fact, fuck, hell with it. I'm going to cut. Cut until we get back there, and we're going to have a look and see what our fossils are. 20 minutes later. Okay, I'm back here. We're going to deposit Mesprit into the death box. In fact, I need to move War Turtle and um, Zekrom out. We need to move Ross out. Let's move him into box two. And we're also going to put Thor into box two as well. He's got Torrent. That's not a good ability. So you've got Torrent and you've got Icy bo Ice Body. Let's actually have a look at you. So you've got. You've got neutral nature ice body. That could be useful if you had hail. You got torrent. Uh, not brilliant. Not brilliant at all, but it's fine. You've got two more encounters we've got to get now. So let's do it. Before we add someone to the team, I'm going to see what we can get. See, see what fossils we've got. So we've got two fossils we can resurrect. Let's go and do that now. Speeding up, just going over here. Should be able to do it now. Okay, fossil. Let's use the dome. So the dome fossil. What's the dome fossil going to be? Vespa Queen. Okay. You got a Vespa Queen. I'm going to name you... I'm going to name you... I'm going to name you Eliza. Hell, I'm going to name you Elizabeth. After Queen Elizabeth. I'm English. And then, also, we can do the cover fossil. And the cover fossil, what's it going to be? Skarmory! Okay, so let's have a quick look at Vespa Quinn. It's level 25. It's 
bug, flying type, pursuit, fury swipes, power gem, heal order, intimidate. I might have to use Vesper Queen. I'm going to have a rejig of the team anyway. I think Vesper Queen's going to join, definitely. But I'm going to have a look at Skarmory and then determine whether or not it's going to be Skarmory or Zekrom that joins. So let's deposit. Let's deposit. I'm sorry, Rayleigh, but you're being a backup one. Because I can't evolve you into a Whimsicott, which is what I want to do. Just because we need a Sunstone. And Sunstones are going to be bloody hard to find right now. Also, while I was running back, I had to do a bit of um, training. And um, basically, I ran into a, um, a trainer, leveled up Gyarados and Gyarados, or leveled up U Eustace and Eustace learnt uh, Dragon Rage. So we got another Pokemon with Dragon Rage. We got a Skarmory. I am going to name you... I'm going to name you... What am I going to name you? I'm going to name you... Um... I'm going to name you Stark. As in Tony Stark, Iron Man, you're an iron bird. I know you're a girl, but meh. Stark, the Skarmory, Steel Fighting Type, Flying Type, Poison Point. Yo, that's pretty clean. But I gotta add Zekrom. I have to add Zekrom to the team. Skarmory's a good backup, Mon. We're gonna use Vesper Queen and. Um, yeah, we're going to use Vesper Queen because I've never used Vesper Queen and I like some bug type Pokemon. So we're going to put Vesper Queen and Zekrom on the team now. So let's do that, shall we? Let's add them both on. Let's move. So Ross is another backup as well. Let's put Zekrom onto the party. Zekrom for Skarmory. There we go. This is how the team is looking. I'm going to head back to um, Castelia and I'm going to do that off screen. Let's have a look at our Mons. So we've got Willow, Eustace, Desmond, Puff, Elizabeth, and Zekrom. Thor, who has a really awful ability, but still, it's fine. So. I'm going to call this an episode. Thank you very much for watching, guys. If you liked this episode, don't forget to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe if you are new. And, yeah, I will see you in the next episode of the Pokemon White Randomizer Nuzlocke. Take care, everybody.